It's one of the rarest beers in the world, and finally, the monks who brew it can start selling it again. This is the St. Sixtus Monastery in Belgium. Like the rest of the world, they've been on a bit of a break for the last few months. No more. One of the monks, Brother Godfrey, tells us it's not exactly business as usual, though. First and foremost, we work by appointment so we can control the flow of the number of people who come here. There's also signs asking people to stay in their car and not walk around. Also, we've put in a red traffic light so that there's only one or two people where the transaction takes place and they can keep enough distance. There's also plexiglass installed and there's disinfecting gel everywhere. Of course, the picture is a bit distorted because at the moment we can only sell on the Belgian market because the borders are closed. This beer normally enjoys a certain international interest and those foreign customers are not allowed to come here at the moment. Brother Gottfried says that despite the limited reopening, they're already seeing a huge boom in demand. Over 5,000 people have made new accounts with them in just the last few days, they say. They only had 30,000 to begin with. In case you were wondering, the monks at St. Sixtus only brew in small batches to keep their profits low, keeping with the monastic lifestyle. So is the beer worth it? This customer seems to think so. Uh, for me, it was very important because um, it was actually the first opportunity to uh, uh, do a real kind of trip again, have a reason to come out again. So that's why I uh, took the time to drive from uh, my hometown uh, to here, which was almost two hours. So.